New Japan is hit hard by COVID-19. I'm Matt Carlins, and this is Just Pro Wrestling News for Wednesday, August 18th, 2021. This update is brought to you by The Wrestling Mayhem Show. Check out the new episode right now, wherever you get your podcast. New Japan Pro Wrestling. New Japan confirmed two of its wrestlers, IWGP World Heavyweight Champion Shingo Takagi and Bushi, have tested positive for COVID-19. Both were pulled from shows starting on Sunday after they were found to have fevers. New Japan said their fevers went down and they're not getting any worse. Both are isolating and receiving treatment. Six other New Japan wrestlers were pulled from shows on Monday and Tuesday due to their contact with Takagi and Bushi. Tatsuya Naito, Sanada, Evil, Yujiro Takahashi, Gato, and Dick Togo. New Japan did not comment on the status of those individuals. New Japan's next show in Japan is next Tuesday. A card for that show has yet to be announced. Takagi is scheduled to defend the IWGP heavyweight title at the Wrestle Grand Slam show on September 5th. El Desperado and Yoshinobu Kanemaru are the winners of this year's Super Junior Tag League. They secured victory by beating the junior tag champs Taiji Ishimori and El Fantasmo on Tuesday's show, and they now want a shot at the titles. AEW City leaders in Chicago announced on Tuesday that they are reinstituting a mask mandate starting on Friday. This is in response to a local surge in COVID-19 cases, and it covers all indoor public spaces regardless of an individual's vaccination status. That includes Friday night's AEW Rampage show at the United Center. The AEW tag titles are on the line on tonight's Dynamite. The Young Bucks are set to defend against Jurassic Express. Also, the final labor of Jericho. Chris Jericho gets his match against MJF, but the Judas Effect is banned, and so is Judas the song. Plus, Sting wrestling live on TNT for the first time in 20 years. He's tagging with Darby Allin against 2.0. Sammy Guevara versus Sean Spears. And Dan Lambert is expected to confront Lance Archer, with Lambert said to be bringing along two UFC champions. On last night's Dark, Matt Hardy pinned Wheeler Yuta after Hardy took off his boot and used it as a weapon. The elite hunter Frankie Kazarian outsmarted and submitted Brandon Cutler, and Jurassic Express and the Varsity Blondes beat the wingmen. WWE. On last night's NXT, MSK beat Imperium's Marcel Bartel and Fabian Eichner to hang on to the NXT tag titles. Walter showed up at ringside during this match, but his attempts to interfere were cut off by his title challenger at TakeOver, Ilya Dragunov. Walter did get the better of him after the match. Earlier, Dragunov pinned Roderick Strong with Torpedo Moscow. Strong's match for the Cruiserweight title promoted for last night's show did not happen. It was announced that the champion Kushida was not medically cleared, so Strong held an open challenge and Dragunov answered. Carmelo Hayes beat Duke Hudson to advance to the finals of the NXT Breakout Tournament. Hayes will face Odyssey Jones, and that match will happen on next Tuesday's NXT. Index, Indy Hartwell and Dexter Loomis beat Jesse Kamea and Robert Stone after Hartwell choked out Kamea. After the match, Hartwell asked Loomis to marry her. She had an engagement ring and everything. He nodded, yes, love wins again. Also last night, Cameron Grimes pinned Josh Briggs with the cave-in. That is just for wrestling news for Wednesday, August 18th. Be sure to check out our social media channels later today for the start of the Future 50, a countdown of the top 50 pro wrestlers aged 25 and younger. Numbers 50 through 41 are going to be revealed today, with more being unveiled every day through the end of the month. This is a collaboration between Just Pro Wrestling News and TheWrestlingRevolution.com. We hope you enjoy it as we spotlight some of the brightest young stars in pro wrestling. Wherever you're listening to this update, make sure you subscribe and hit that notification bell so you don't miss our next update tomorrow morning. I'm Matt Carlins. Thank you for listening. This show is a member of the Sorgatron Media Podcast Network. Find out more at sorgatronmedia.com.